What's up guys, Chris from Closet Weave here and we're back in my closet to watch episode 3 of the Elusive Samurai. So last episode we started off with um, Tokoyuki's older brother and the uncle. Uncle sold his older brother out and because he wanted to, to gain status, go up in ranks, but then I think everything he gained he just lost it all he was out in the streets still playing that dice game then he thought about tokoyuki and how um if he sells him out he can he can go up, up even further so then tokoyuki and i think the priest's name is yorishige um they went to go see him in, out in the streets and then yorishige introduced tokoyuki to two two other kids look like they're going to be making a team together look pretty strong and they decided to work under Tokoyuki so they came up with a plan to take down the uncle and beautiful animation during that fight scene Tokoyuki's monster came out the gleeful monster the two other kids got to see just how strong he is and then that's when they decided they would want to work under him and then they provided that opening for Tokoyuki to take out his uncle and offered <laughs> the uncle's head as a souvenir to uh, his older brother and everyone that got taken out during the um, uh, the invasion or the the coup by Takauji. Yeah, he had that epic line saying this is a souvenir for them while they go and pass to the other side. Um, but yeah, this anime is very beautiful, amazing animation, crazy story. Uh, so let's see what happens next. Let's jump into episode 3 of The Elusive Samurai, a forest inhabited by a god. <laughs> yeah, first W for the boy. Oh, <laughs> that monster inside is happy. <laughs> Shoot. <laughs> I want to see how strong that man is. Takauji. You're coming back. Tokuyuki. Oh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, that boy is quick. <laughs> That's great. This is just the beginning of his journey. Yoshige. Oh, we got some ladies. <laughs> you cannot escape him. Oh, his domain expansion. This is his home court. Mm. Oh lord. <laughs> you got double the training. Another trap. <laughs> Hey, he, he saved you. <laughs> I mean, you can still be a little wary about him because of all the betrayal you've dealt with, but so far he's been pretty good. <laughs> Just like his father, to be a puppet ruler. Right. At least he's he's calling himself out. He hasn't proven himself yet. 
<laughs> oh, he's right there. Zanyo promised to God. <laughs> oh, so he is a god. He's the god. Oh, he's gonna stop the rain. Oh boy, here we go, Yorishige. Show him what's up. Ooh. <laughs> Control the weather. So mystical, so whimsical. Jesus. <laughs> Do you believe me now? Okay, Yorishige, you're a god. <laughs> you you won me over, Yorishige. Who the heck are all these people? <laughs> Hola. So he's an actual god. <laughs> yep, time to study, Tokuyuki. <laughs> okay, so now what does that mean? Takauji has a god watching over him. Because when he was going crazy, he said he's like hearing a voice. <laughs> or he just gonna betray you. <laughs> it was all an act. <laughs> uh... <laughs> he is a scammer. But he really controlled the rain, right? <laughs> okay, so he's actually a god. <laughs> Give us the lesson. <laughs> Starting from the bottom. <laughs> Let's get the names. Kojiro! You mean the swordsman? Kojiro. Ayako. Oh, secret arts, huh? She got that magic like you, Yorishige. <laughs> That's crazy. They're all the same age. <laughs> They're about to grow up together. As he grows into the new ruler. Yep. <laughs> the Dragon Ball Z reference? R.I.P. <laughs> They're gonna be more like friends than like master servant. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they, they know they have no chance against you in tag. <laughs> Take a dump? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Everyone got their own personality. <laughs> like crazy. Oh jeez, <laughs> what they about to run into out here? <laughs> 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 
snipe. Oh. The boy just slicing branches like it's nothing. Oh god. <laughs> Poor rabbit. <laughs> a predator. Jesus. Like a boar beast. God dang. <laughs> Ox demon. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's looking like dinner. <laughs> that thing tanky. Yeah. <laughs> Can't even pierce it. All right, show us some of them secret arts, girl. <laughs> okay, good plan. <laughs> What's under the tree? Got a trap ready? Gonna be chasing you. Use your gleeful monster. <laughs> Dude, this is crazy just for a little hunting mission. Oh! They got like some obsidian there. Made a nice little blade. Giant blade. They're gonna push that thing off the edge. <laughs> that thing understands English. The setup. Jesus. <laughs> hey, y'all making a great team already. Two W's, <laughs> last two episodes. Dang. Making me feel bad for this thing. But yeah, at least, at least she was showing respect to what they hunted. <laughs> oh. We're coming up with a name. Yeah, like I said, it's not like master-servant relationship. They're literally going to be growing up as friends. Looking out for each other. Okay, that's a nice name. <laughs> I like that name. Go from elusive samurai to elusive warriors. <laughs> that boy killed it all. <laughs> he had to cleanse it. <laughs> <laughs> Rejected. And that's what they gotta settle with. Oh. Oh, never mind. Somebody else, the next enemy. Well, there we go. <laughs> what they gotta worry about next. Alright, so started off. Um Introduce, reintroducing the team. So we got Aiko, the girl, the strong girl, Kojiro, the best samurai swordsman, and Shizuku, um, Yorishige's little apprentice, and yeah, they're they're working with Tokuyuki, and Tokuyuki didn't want to do any studying, no training, uh, but then Yorishige had to prove to him that he's a god. They he was at their shrine, and then. 
he, he did that whole thing with the rain, controlling the rain, but then he did kind of scam Tokuyuki by having <laughs> all those people act um, under the cliff and whatnot. And then once Tokuyuki agreed to, 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 to study and whatnot, <laughs> he told them to, they could just leave. And then uh, Tokuyuki and his retainers had to hunt that beast in the forest and even the animation for just a hunt was very well done uh, showed their great teamwork once again thinking on the fly using Tokuyuki's elusiveness to guide the beast to, to the edge of that cliff where it looked like obsidian but that rock that they shaped into a blade so they can just have it fall off the cliff and take it out and Yoroshige looks like he is an actual god with with those powers of manipulating the rain and with his appetite because um he took the, he he ate all of that that entire beast or ox or boar thingy and then at the end looks like we're gonna deal with um the next problem looking like a little army or something or some bandits that know about yoroshige so can't wait to see what happens next. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next one.